All righty, so here we are, back with back Papa Taz. Papa again, putting the hamburgers on. So we've got our hamburgers. Make them up to you, whatever size you make them. I usually make them about that size. There we are. Yeah. So about the size of a tennis bowl. Yeah. And we've got the onions cooking and we've got the sausages already cooking. Yeah, because there's a bit of fat in the meat. You don't have to worry about putting too much fat on your thing because that don't helps cook you. Yeah. So you don't need oil or anything yeah. on the... the, the no, but you've got a little bit of fat in there which helps... Helps cook them through? Cook them through better, yeah. Yeah. I made them a bit big today, but normally you make them whatever size you like. There's only four of us here, so we don't want... Don't need too, ma too big, too well, many. We will leave some over get David to take her for lunch on Monday. That sounds like a plan. Well, so you usually get about eight. This is a bit bigger because we've got the ham in this lot. Normally I don't have ham, it's just usually the burgers, but I had a bit of ham in the fridge, so I thought, well, we'll make them hamburgers. And what they could always be, they should be hamburgers. That's right. You can, if you wanted, probably use um, pork mince, which would make them a... Pork mince, that'd be nice. We, we have had them. I've made them with pork mince before. So all that ingredients, we're going to get, what? Well, normally I'd We've get got about six ten. there, about ten. Normally so we'll get about eight out of that lot. Yeah. But they are quite big burgers today. Today. Better than Macca's? Uh, Macca's have got nothing on this. Macca's have got nothing on that. You've heard it right from the source. Macca's is only second class meat. You could take it for a man that's worked in the abattoirs for 50 years and in small good factories over that time as well. And the meat they use in Macca's is and uh, what will I say, when they were made in America, they were using old bull meat. Yeah. And the old cows, well, once the cows were finished from milking, that was the meat that went over to America for the hamburger. Ah. And that is coming from a person who knows all about it. More words of wisdom from Papa Taz Daz. Right, because I work in the abattoirs when... The Americans come out and they shut down the abattoirs of working at it locally because they reckon they wasn't up to scratch for the but the American um, abattoirs were worse than ours. And that is the gospel truth and no one can say it's not right. Because I know all about it. There you go. And that is the truth. A little bit of a taste test. That's how good it is, mate. No cooking. Beautiful. Bit of steak tartare. Beautiful. So we'll stop it there and we'll be back in a few minutes and show you what they look like when they're being cooked. 